I cried last night when no one was around. Some masculine cried last night or recently. They could have been upset about something. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Four of Cups reversed. They're ready to accept happiness, true happiness, true love. They're ready to seize a new opportunity. They're ready to come out of some kind of regret. They're tired of being alone. They're tired of being lonely, tired of being bored, tired of uh, being isolated. Two of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. They're choosing to invest into you guys. Some of you guys, they could have multiple women pregnant. They cried over something with a woman and some kids. And the choices that they made. The moon. Yeah, at nighttime they cried. Pisces, Cancer. They also cried over a karmic feminine. I see a karmic feminine too that cried also. Five of Swords reverse. She couldn't get revenge on somebody, couldn't outdo somebody. Whoever was trying to compete. She looks like she was trying to compete to have this person taking care of her kids or something. Or another income. Two of Cups reversed. And uh, strength. There was some kind of miscommunication. These people are just drifting apart. Could have been a karmic masculine that cried too. Somebody knows somebody don't trust them no more. They did way too much competing. Somebody's trying to figure out how they're going to put food on the table too is what I see here for their children. You guys could be a Leo, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn is also here. Any sign really. Somebody's very intimidated by your guys' confidence, your strength. You guys could be somebody very charismatic. You guys could have a lot of energy or very in control of your guys' energy. Intelligence triumphing over brutality. You guys are so strong. You guys could have seen something in dreams or had some kind of visions. There's some kind of secret travel plans. Could be the end of a contract, end of a marriage, end of a lease agreement. For some of you guys, this was just a connection, a relationship just out of convenience or for social status, for money. Somebody could be returning some kind of uh, money or money that was loaned or borrowed. Somebody's crying a lot because they know somebody's gonna is um, invested into you or going to invest into you or reinvest into you guys. You guys are gonna be fearing. You guys are gonna be feeling very joyful, and somebody's fearing that. You're going to be having a lot of fun. Whoever was trying to compete with you is very scared about that. This could have been a long distance competition or somebody that lives long distance. Some kind of rivalry. Could be a sibling rivalry. She was in a relationship or married for convenience, whoever that is. Karmic. Karmic. 
somebody's really annoyed with some kind of relationship. Some kind of obligations are here also. Okay, Spirit, show me this. Show me these people that cried recently or last night when nobody was around. King of Cups reverse. Optimism. They're going to be traveling. They've been in their feelings. Yeah. Moon and Sagittarius. I believe the moon is still in Sagittarius at the time of this reading. So this was last night or it's going to be tonight. Something like that. Within the last two and a half days. They've cried recently. Okay. Could be a Sagittarius. This person could have their moon in Sagittarius. They definitely cried last night for sure. Um, Queen of Pentacles reverse cried last night recently they know this person is choosing you they learned they learned that this person has chosen you is attracted to you lusting after you having wanted to have sex with you they're going to make some kind of adaption to you and they were heated they found something out and they got heated they could have cried out of anger very jealous envious feeling very insecure this masculine is very upset with whoever this female is. Cried last night. What else for a king of cups? Strength. Leo. They know that they have the... Uh, this came out in one of the last readings. This came out on top of this lion. This female is taming this lion. They know that they have to act. It's time to act now. I feel like this masculine wanted some female to be intimidated by them or scared of them, fear them or be confused, be in the dark, shut out. But in reality, this female is stronger than this lion. She's got control, healthy control over this lion. Moon and Virgo. He's been crying because he knows he's got to work towards a connection with you. He's in his, both of this energies is moon. Moon and moon. Could have their moon in the sixth house. I see Sagittarius moon, sixth house for some of y'all. This person, uh, this karmic feminine could have Aries placements. Libra placements. Okay, what else? Um, masculine energy been crying recently or last night service it's time for service that's why they got to be of service to you they have duties or obligations with you possibly something with their job or work somebody could be um, on their deathbed or facing death or being in bad health ill health could have passed over loved ones looking over the situation They're about to be of some kind of service. They can't trick you. Trickery reverse. This masculine can't trick you about their heart, their feelings, nothing like that. Or whatever kind of growth that is. Could have been trying to stunt your guys' growth or child's growth. And this karmic feminine, been crying. Because she, well, this is just obvious. Because she knows she's getting released. could have literally been a death or something with the graveyard she could have been doing graveyard spells or trying to create a death she knows she's getting released there's all that rain and stuff she's in a very gloomy dark energy A masculine that has cried recently. This is like tears of joy. Because um, your family wishes are coming true. Whoever was trying to defeat you. This female was trying to compete and defeat you. They've been crying because they see how, how much stronger you guys are than whoever that is. 
they were dealing with this person for a long time that was had shit over them dark magic over them or that was possessing them controlling them they were not able to overcome whoever this dark person is they respect you they respect you because you have strength over them you tamed whatever dark forces those were family wishes are coming true this is why they've been crying and they know it's time to get back to basics somebody could be going to basic training also rejoining the military is what i see here re-enlisting into the military and going um, back to basic training you you are highly thought of this karmic is thinking a lot about some female crying she knows he respects you a lot she was deluding herself also some karmic she knows her connection is over or there's tensions in their relationship or their friendship is over whatever kind of connection that is it ain't good what else been crying time to go out and have fun you guys could be going out on a date having fun somebody could like grapes could be changing their diet eating healthier Okay, what else crying somebody could have told you good luck see you later type of thing they're coming back involvement with the law they were fearful if they ran away it's because they were fearful show me the service for a masculine some masculine is going into some kind of service they're giving me some military service. Y'all could have been on a break. They didn't love themselves. What is a stop energy service? Somebody was trying to stop them from taking actions towards some kind of service or duties, obligations, work obligations, possibly providing for you guys' as family and kids. They don't want them to improve their life or come out of the cold or... Um, they don't want them having improvements in their life. They don't want things to get better for somebody. They want this person to be not shit. King of Pentacles reverse. They this is a karmic. They want them to be unstable because they know that they're not going to be taking care of them or not going to be taking care of them anymore. They want this person to not be shit, to not have no goals, no aspirations, no career goals, no money. They want them to be broke. They could have been trying to drain them financially. They want them to be immature just so that they don't um, be of service duty to um, somebody else or another woman. So they're trying to stop something with some kind of duty. They don't want this person to have any, any no self-love, no self-healing, nothing like that. They wanted this person to be codependent upon them okay, financially and live off of some female. Could be moving up out of a home. This could be family members. Four of Wands reversed and Four of Cups reversed. They're not interested in doing none of that. This person's just mad because they were trying to use this person, fold this person, take advantage of them. They was trying to trick them. Okay, what else? Some um, duty, service, masculine energy. I cried recently. I feel shitty for how I treated you. That could be why they cried also. Very soon. Something is going to happen very soon for you guys. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. What's going to happen very soon, Spirit, for some masculine that's been crying? 
they made unwise choices. They're learning what they can from the situation. They're reviewing everybody's motives very soon. Your person has been watching you guys a lot, spying. Yeah, they've been getting, they've been watching um, some tarot or consulting with the high priestess. Have patience. This person is trying to um, decide what they want before they act. Before they act. Page of air reversed. Awakening could be a Pisces. Look at things from a different perspective. A temporary standstill. This person's afraid to be their authentic, true self. This is a masculine. Ten of fire. Too much work. Accept help from others. Life is out of balance. Stress related. They're stressed for some reason. They're thinking a lot. Having a lot of difficulties, challenges mentally. This person has some um, issues with their self-esteem. What is this ten of wands? An exciting new opportunity, career advancement, change your life now. This is also the karmic energy with this Ten of Wands. There's a lot of people watching. You guys are watching readings on each other or something. Okay, so a karmic partner, what they're going to try to do, they're going to try to do some kind of magic or manipulate the situation because they know the situation is balancing out for you guys. There's some kind of moderation. They know this person is going to cooperate and make compromises. Wait for perfect timing. Your masculine is going to come towards you very soon or contact you very soon. Okay. They know some karmic partners watching them are on their back though, stalking them. So they're afraid if they come towards you, some karmic is going to do some kind of dark magic and then ha have them act out and reckless and stuff. So it looks like they still believe in their mind that some karmic has more power over them. So it looks like they need to still work on their uh, self-esteem. Some car, um, some masculines. They're afraid for an exciting new opportunity because they're afraid of some karmic partner. Somebody's overwhelming their stay now. Whoever they're staying with is tired of them staying there. Resurrection. I'm scared to talk to you. Some of them are staying with some friends or something. Could be staying with the Sagittarius. You're, over you're overwhelming your stay now. Higher font, page of pentacles. Yeah, there's this is the new offer, new opportunity. Your person's learning a lot from some readings or some mentor, whoever they're staying with. Could be staying with somebody older that's teaching them something. Some authoritative figure or some head of the household. This is Taurus energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They want this person to move out for some of you guys. This could be a Pisces or Cancer. Your person's already awakened. They're just scared. Somebody's trying to push them up out of their um, home. They're afraid to, to move out. Six of Swords reverse. They're afraid because... Yeah, they're afraid what the karmic is going to do. They're scared the karmic is going to... This karmic could be mentally, um, emotionally unstable. They're afraid they're going to do some kind of dark magic or they're afraid to relive an experience from the past. This is why they're trying to keep a hold of things. Yeah, they're scared because they know... They know some karmic is stalking them, watching them like a hawk day by day. The devil, Ace of Cups. 
Yeah, this karmic, they're scared about that. They're afraid the karmic is going to um, do some crazy shit if they commit to you or find this out. Wow. Scared of the karmic. Uh oh. Could be afraid of some kind of crisis. That slipped out of my hand. I don't like to take it unless it actually comes out right. They wanted them paying half of their mortgage or half of their rent. They wanted you to think he was homosexual or gay. 